All right, good morning everyone. It's approximately 7 a.m. at my location. This is the blaster that I got from the, the Young Punisher owner. I still can't say his name. Anyway, um, it's a basic long strike with clip lock removed. Trigger lock is not removed, but that's not a big deal. I usually don't remove mine from my blasters anyway. He included two clips with full ammo plus two darts for the reflex. Sorry, I'm still waking up. Reflex is nice because it's now like a pump action and he had it to uh, trim it down so as you can see it doesn't interfere with any clip that you might put on there. It probably will work even with the Raider drum now. But yeah, you now fire it like we just you now fire it with your thumb. The air restrictors are removed from both blasters. And uh, so it gets pretty good ranges. Like I said, clip lock removed. Oh, one dart left. Doesn't really matter, I don't need to use it. And uh, what's nice about the long strike is instead of uh, carrying only one shot, one extra clip in the back, like my. Uh, here, my long shot, but this is the suppressed one. It can hold two extra rounds, two extra magazines, which is nice. Priming the blaster is nice and smooth. There is no spring compression or anything that I can see, but it still gets pretty good ranges. So, if uh, originally, if I have the uh, parts available, I might change this reflex cover to blue simply so it'll go with the overall scheme of the blaster. I mean, this yellow does stand out, but since there's yellow on the blaster itself, it probably actually sort of accents it, and and color scheme is actually quite good, and, it, well, it also reminds me of my long shot, since, as you can see, it's got a blue priming grip, and blue, there's a blue prim priming grip on this one, too. So, essentially, the closest comparison I can give to this gun is my personal long shot, which I still love very much and will take to just about any war. I'll show you a few things with that. Um, this is a relatively good blaster, although I'd have to do one thing. Hold on. Might need to go off camera for this. A lot of you have been wondering, how do I get the stock off that's already attached? Well, I did get this off once, but that was with a mass amount of force. Massive amount of force. Ugh. Sorry guys, I don't drink coffee. So uh, give me a moment. And there you go. Stock has been removed. Um, he originally was going to do a removable stock mod, but unfortunately he forgot to do it before he reassembled and glued the blaster shut. But that was no big deal because as you see, I just actually just got this off. How I did this was because I stood this on the ground like this, put the heels of my feet right here on these ridges, and then pulled the blaster by the handle straight up. So that way it just popped off, which I'm, since I now have the stock off, I can make the removable stock mod like he wanted to. But since I've already got my stock that's removable, I'll just pop that on for now. As you can see, it's a lot easier to pop off. So yeah, it's, uh, this is actually a relatively good blaster, I mean. The only thing I might disapprove of is, well, paint. I mean, I don't usually paint my blasters, but if you can look closely, the paint matches. It's blue, but it doesn't match all the way, but that's okay. I mean, nobody's perfect modder, and I may, I'll admit that right now. I am not a perfect modder. I mean, I have flaws in my work. There are things I want to correct. First ones never get the best job. And I will admit that. So anyway, this is actually a relative this is actually a really good blaster. I like this one quite a bit. I might use it a couple times, but still if I like I said, if I'm going to a war, I'm bringing mine. This is my long strike. No, not my long strike, my long shot. Stock still collapses, which is no big deal right now because I still need to get a new spring for it.
but yeah. This is my uh, suppressed long shot. As you can see, I'm not afraid of dry firing it. But I've got in there for a suppressor. Now, I want to show you one quick thing with this, and then the video will be over.